So today I just finished watching The Golden Child. Here are my thoughts. In an attempt to explore the vast landscape of cinema, I decided to watch The Golden Child, a film that in my opinion proved to be quite the challenge to complete. The plot, although unique, did not captivate me, and I found the acting to be underwhelming. Ultimately, I would rate this movie a 4 out of 10. A heads up for anyone who has not seen the film, this review will discuss plot details that could be considered revealing. You've been warned. The Golden Child, a fantasy comedy released in the mid-1980s, centers on the story of a private investigator named Chandler Gerald, Eddie Murphy. He is tasked with finding and protecting the titular Golden Child, a young boy believed to be the savior of humanity with extraordinary powers. Throughout the movie, Gerald encounters various obstacles, both mundane and mystical, as he embarks on a journey to rescue the boy from the clutches of evil forces. From the get-go, I found the story to be quite flat. It did not grip me in a way that kept me engaged, and at times it seemed to meander without a clear sense of direction. While the movie attempts to mix comedy, action, and fantasy elements, it struggles to strike a balance between these genres. The result is a disjointed experience that makes it hard to maintain interest in the narrative. Moreover, the acting in The Golden Child, which should have been one of the film's strongest suits, also falls flat. While Eddie Murphy is a renowned comedic actor, his performance in this movie was not up to par. I found the character of Chandler Gerald to be shallow, and Murphy's portrayal of the character seemed to lack depth and sincerity. In addition to the weak character development, I also found the movie's pacing to be problematic. Scenes often felt too drawn out, with too much time spent on aspects that didn't necessarily contribute to the story. This, combined with the lack of a compelling plot, made for a viewing experience that felt like a chore to endure. The movie does have some redeeming qualities. The special effects, given the time of its release, are somewhat impressive, and there are a few moments of genuine humor. However, these elements are not enough to salvage the overall experience. In conclusion, I found The Golden Child to be a difficult movie to finish due to its flat story and subpar acting. While it may have been an ambitious attempt to blend genres, it ultimately falls short in its execution. I would give this movie a 4 out of 10, and I would not highly recommend it. If you decide to watch it, do so with tempered expectations and an open mind, and you may find some enjoyment in the film.